Hey guys, Missy Kane here. So glad you're tuning in to Fit and Fun. We're going to have a great show. We're going to burn some calories. We're going to get some steps in and do a little strength work all at the same time. And um, I've got Elizabeth the Spiff, Elizabeth the Spiff Opal on the show. <laughs> thanks That's for right. coming on. No, thanks for having me. <laughs> yeah, I see her um, on Fox 43 yeah. every other Tuesday morning. That's right. You're in the studio. and Yeah. And man, you have to bring a lot of stuff in. Too. I do. I get to be the style consultant for West Ham Mall. So I pretty much have yes. the mall at my disposal, which is fun. <laughs> but I <laughs> do bring a lot of stuff in. She's got a great blog, and we're going to pull up some pictures now. But um, And that's really how you got started was with your blog, um, getting into style and hair and makeup and all that, right? Yes. I realized after graduating that I could talk about clothes all day long and I have a degree <laughs> in writing, so I thought, why not yeah. put them together and start a blog? So, so it's cool. been neat to see how far it's come. <laughs> and you've got um, a baby. I do. He's not really a baby anymore though, right? No, he's really not. I like to think that he is, but he's <laughs> he's going on two years. Aww. He'll be two years in a couple months. So, wow, he's so cute. He's <laughs> Thanks. So cute. But uh, some of the things that y'all, let's do this big arm circle. Some of the things that you'll see, she even talks about baby clothes, but that's your little, yes. that's your boys, right? Yeah, Jackson, yeah. And my husband, Dayton. <laughs> yeah. He has a lot of hair like you, doesn't he? He does, <laughs> yes. <laughs> I know. I thought, boy, I hope if, when I have a girl that she'll have a lot of hair too because I, I can do something with it. <laughs> I remember you announcing that you were pregnant with Moira Kay was back yes. on the show then, and I was there that day. Well, that and seems you, like a long time. Somehow you spoofed her or something, and that was you with yes. Abby. <laughs> yes. Talking about workout clothes, yeah. so that's perfect. And you work out sometimes with Abby. Haven't you done some yes, workouts with Abby? Yes, we do a boot camp together. Yeah. Abby's amazing. She can do anything, I tell you. Oh, she is. And Brandon's been on the show, Brandon Bates. Yes, he's fun. <laughs> he's always got me laughing in the studio. <laughs> he is, and he's a big outdoorsman. You know, yeah. He do mountain biking and all that. Okay, well, we're going to warm it up with Elizabeth and then get into some... A little bit of kickboxing, easy things. So I promise, <laughs> I promise, because we really haven't practiced too much yet. We're gonna do back and forth lunges, and I'll show you guys how, what I mean. Back and forth, we're gonna like lift up those arms and back and forth, just warming it up. Kind of a modified little yoga. I, I love yoga, but I'm not very good at it. I need to. Yes, I'm the same way. It feels so good afterwards. I know. I was at it, not so botanical gardens. Not too long, not last week, and they're doing yoga in the gardens oh, at 2:30 this morning. Beautiful. Meg has been on the show, and she that'd be kind of fun to do. A few more of these. Let's do about three more. One more, and then we'll hold it. Elizabeth, we're gonna like just hold this position, kind of lift those shoulders up. Good job. A little bit of a stretch on that back foot too. Yeah, that feels good. And swing it down the other side, like this, and on and up like this. So you were telling the students here at Pellis if you study, you kind of got your job in a contest with a blog, correct? I did. Simon Malls did a call for local bloggers to write about the stuff at their mall um, because they started this huge website where everybody was just talking about different style. Mm -hmm. It was called Style Setter. Right. So I applied for that and got it and got to do some fun things with our mall for about a year right and then Simon decided they wanted to discontinue it for the local malls they kept it for the national ones um, but our mall was with, yeah. loving what I was doing and mm -hmm. then I got to talk about things on TV so I really enjoyed That's it funny. and I'm glad and they said let's continue this relationship so yeah. I became well, their I'm, staff and I live close to you but I'm really glad that our mall, malls around here are doing okay especially me too Westin, you know? I know I'm such a in-person kind of shopper like mm -hmm. i'll look online kind of to pre-shop but i have to touch it and yeah, feel it like and it. try it on so i'm all about that well i know some of my folks watching are mall walkers and i always think and i used to leave classes there and it would be good because then i'd go oh i gotta come back <laughs> <laughs> i see this at pottery I barn i need to come back right. i really love that so i always said i needed to, if i was gonna walk a mall it'd have to be when it's closed or else <laughs> it would cost us a lot of money <laughs> All right, we're going to do something. We're going to really exercise, I promise that. But we're going to start out with just some punches back and forth. Just nice, easy punches. And kind of use um, those knees a little bit back and forth, up and down. Good job. Jackie Kellogg's been on this show, and I know she's a friend of oh, yeah. Abby's. And uh -huh. she um, does, like, some kind of body combat class. And, boy, oh, you get cool. work out of here. Yeah. So we'll do a modified type of little body combat stuff. Good job. Keep it going, guys. 
looking good. About 20 more seconds. Got that upper body warmed up good. A few more, then we're gonna do just some knee lifts. Okay, march it out. And then what we're gonna do next is just lift, kind of exaggerate, lift those knees up and act like we're kind of breaking a board on them. So we've got something that we're pulling down, back and forth. I forgot to tell Elizabeth too that the lights get really nice and warm here. So we yeah. do extra sweat, you know? <laughs> True. <laughs> back and forth. Looking good out there, a few more. Looking good. This really engages your abs, too. Yeah, that's a good point. God, those abs. Four more. Here's four. And three. Two. One. March it out. All right. We're going to kind of combine a few things, too. What we're going to do is um, combine a jab and a cross. But first, let me go through a jab. So a jab just looks like this. It looks like just punching out and back like that. That's kind of a quick jab. Just punch, punch. Good job. That other arm can be just kind of held up close to your, underneath your ear. Good. Good. A few more. Looking good. Four, three, two. March it out. All right. Now, a cross would look like this. It'd be a step, cross, lean back, step, cross, lean back, step, cross. So it's kind of an opposite arm coming across your body. Step, cross, step. I think they call this little move like a fade. You're kind of fading back, trying to avoid that yeah. punch. I need to learn all this. My daughter, my future son-in-law is a UFC fighter. Oh, cool. So he's got hot sauce. He's been on doing his boxing moves. Good job. I know I love learning about fighting and self-defense and all that. I'm all about that. <laughs> yes, I think he got into like jiu-jitsu and, and some of that first. Mm -hmm. He was an ice bear hockey player. Oh, cool. So he's kind of combined. I love that. the ice bears. <laughs> four more. Here's four. Three. Two. One. All right, Marcia. I'm going to switch places with you okay. so that you can see what I'm doing. And so we're going to do the same thing so that we're equally muscled yeah <laughs> so we're doing jabs on this side back and forth back and forth it's just almost where we're leaning out and in have a quick motion good you can get out there hold that other arm kind of up by that chin outside the underneath the ear good a few more you got it should be breathing a little heavier Four more. Four, three, two, one. March it out. Second thing we did was that cross. So it's like I was using my right arm. Now I'm going to take that left arm across. Looks like this. Just step, cross, and back. Step, cross. So we're just leaning out and coming back. Lean out, come back. Kind of that fade move. Getting away from that hit. And back. Good job. So you can go on the spiff.com anytime and you see like Easter fashion, yeah. hair ideas, hair, right? Hair, yeah. Products too. Yes, I like to do product reviews because I get so tired of standing in the drugstore aisle having no idea what would work. So I try to share my opinion on that as much as possible so that people can go in and get a little educated. As as how much things cost. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, because I really don't spend a lot of money on clothes, but I don't wear the same outfit a lot over and over again. Well, I know one of your blogs is like four ways to wear a jean jacket or yeah. jean you know. Yeah, right it's now, actually, jacket. I've got a way to reuse a bridesmaid's dress on the blog. So, yeah, you know, there's just all kinds of fun, creative ways you can wear your clothes, and I just like to help people with ideas and inspiration. You have a business to come into your closets, too. You yes, I've thought about that for yeah. a long time. Next year. Yeah, I need to. <laughs> four more. Three, two, one, march it out. I'm gonna let you come over here and get a little bit of water. Okay. All right, so we're gonna mix it up. So we've been doing, we're gonna do the kickboxing moves and then we're gonna do a little bit of light weights. If you have weights, grab them. You've got some, yeah, get those. Those black are a little too heavy. All right, this one's gonna be a combination move. So we're gonna start out kind of like in a squat. Our weights on our heels. 
and we're going to start out and what, with our hands down by our knees. We're going to pull it up and kind of rack it on our shoulders, right above our shoulders. And then if it's not too heavy a weight for you, put it up over your head, shoulders, and back down. So we're just going to keep going, shoulders. If you have high blood pressure, they'll tell you to really have a lighter weight and maybe just keep it close to your ears and not go over your head. But if you're fine, just shoulders. You probably get a lot of weight lifting with a one year old. Yes, <laughs> I do. And I try to balance my arms because I'm a lefty. So I'm always carrying them on the left and I need to keep that right arm. As yeah. so. Well, that's one reason they say sometimes, you know, machines at a place are good. But if you use uh, free weights, it kind of helps you see where you're weak. True. To work on that balance. I know weight lifting is what really helped me lose all the baby weight. More so, I feel like, than cardio. Mm -hmm. Or at least mixing small amounts of cardio. Right, that intensity mm -hmm. and um, getting more muscle on. Muscle burns more calories even when you're at rest. Yes, which is that's what I thing. like to think about when I'm eating like pizza. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Two more. I can feel it. One more after this. Last one. Good job, set those weights down. Okay, now in between, after we do our weights, we're gonna do something core. So we're gonna come down to here, and you guys can do it one of two ways. You can go like this. We're gonna do it for 20 seconds. If you wanna come all the way down on your forearms, that's fine too, either way. And we're just gonna hold this for another 15 to 20 seconds. If you're shaking, in your midriff, that's a good sign. <laughs> You're using good. those abdominals. Good job, everybody. 10 more. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good job. Let's get on up. All right, I hope you guys are sweating because I'm sweating. <laughs> Elizabeth I'm doesn't a look bit, like yeah. she's sweating. <laughs> she probably knows makeup that you sweat in, right? <laughs> well, my friends make fun of me because I don't sweat very much. Like, I don't right. know why. I grew up in Florida, so the air sweat oh, for me there. So that's, right. so that's the only thing I could think of. <laughs> All right, we're going to do kicks now, and then we're going to um, do a combination move. But kicks are just going to be like this, kind of pulling those arms back and kicking at the same time. Good. Kind of like we've got a board in front, and we're trying to through the board and we got a board in our hands we're doing that over our knee good looking good getting that heart rate up 10 more good job about six more four three two one good job all right now combination move i'm going to show you guys and Elizabeth, what I mean, it's going to be like a one, two, three, cross, back, two, three. One, two, three, cross, back, two, three. One, two, three, cross, back, two, three. One, two, three, give a cross, back, two. One, two, three, cross. Looking good, everybody. One, two, three, cross. Good job. One, two, three, cross. And see, you can make it into a just a walking pattern. Or if you need a little bit more, you can kind of shuffle up. So it's either one, two, three, cross, or you can shuffle. Shuffle, two, three, cross, and back, two, three. Shuffle, two, three, cross. You got it. Three more, and across, and back. Two more. Shuffle, two, three, cross, and back. One more, shuffle, two, three, cross, and back. March it out. We're going to switch switcheroo so that you can see what I'm doing on this side. Okay. If I do it the same way, I'll try. But remember, so you can do it either one of two ways. It's the same pattern, but you can do the one, two, three, cross, and back. Or you can do the shuffle, two, three, cross, and back, two, three. So it's one, two, three, cross, and back. Either way. One, two, three. Give me some attitude with that cross. Kind of get down a little bit lower with your knees and really give me some oomph. One, two, three, and cross. Using that lower body and upper body too. Good. Good job. Two, three, cross. Or it could be a shuffle. Two, three, cross. Back. Two, three. One, two, three, 
Make sure you're protecting your face. One, two, three. Cross That's the money maker. Yep. One, two, three. Cross and back. It's hard to watch my future son-in-law on those. He's eight and two, oh. so he does very well, but man. <laughs> that would be hard. I have a hard time watching strangers do it, so I can imagine. <laughs> He's the nicest guy, too. And cross. Two more. One, two, three. Cross. Last one. One, two, three. Cross. And march it out. A little water break. Elizabeth's got some over there. Elizabeth Ogles on with us today. The spiff.com for all your style information. That's right. Hair, fashion, prom. I know not too long ago. Yeah. We were doing something um, for teenagers. Yes. And a lot of some of the midriff things, right? I think I'm too old for that. <laughs> no more midriff. Yeah. Sure. It is a great way to just show a little peak of skin without giving away too much information. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> it's cute. Okay, weights again. We're going to do, um, well, I'm going to show you a different one. I like this. We can use two weights. And I call it like uh, a plie with um, fly. So, a fly looks like this. You know, a double fly is like this. We're going to do a single fly with a plie. Missy? But it's, <laughs> we're just going to do the same side over and over and switch. So it's going to be a, like a plie behind us. And we may come up here a little bit. It might be a little safer. Like this. So it's like we're just taking a step behind. And, and this one is all you're doing with this is you're going to keep it down here and you're swinging it out. Okay, gotcha. But with a little bit of a bend. Yeah. Like that. So it looks like this, guys. It's plie back together. Plie. Good. We're gonna do about 10 of these. And we're getting some good deltoid in your shoulders. And lower body too. Yeah. You're gonna feel that quad. Good. And actually your other arm, even just holding yeah, this in like say. a hammer curl type of position. Feel that everywhere. Good job. Five more on this side, you can do it. Four. Three. Two, one more. Looking good. Okay. Woo! In between, let's do some shoulder shrugs. Good. Big deep breaths. Now, so the same thing we did. So we're doing that, you know, kind of like a bent arm fly. And then we're taking our other leg back and doing that plie. Good. It's kind of like we're swinging the door open and close. About your thigh. Yeah, come down about your thigh. Yeah, and not let that go. A little bit lower on your left. Yeah, lower down to your hip. Okay. Oh yeah, you know, you're going down plenty on your oh, leg. Okay. I can't get down that low. <laughs> but our left arm should come kind of close see, to your I thigh. Woo. Five more, we can do it. <laughs> yeah, feels good. Four. Yeah, you're going down. Well, you're young. <laughs> I can't go down as low as you're going your legs. Two, one more. Isn't that a good one? That is a good yeah, one. Yeah, let's set these down. It hits so many places. Woo. Okay, now we're going to do a little bit of a side plank. So we're going to kind of isolate this area. So we'll do it two different. We're going to have to flip side. First of all, we're going to go down to the, you can always use a countertop too. Like if somebody had a countertop, they could do the same thing without as much of an angle. It'd be a little easier, but we're going to go down to our, our little steps here. On my new carpet. You approved of my yeah, new carpet. This is very pretty. I like it. Knoxville Salvage. I love finding. Don't you love finding places? See, I love Knoxville. Yes. Tile, all that stuff. Uh -huh. And you kind of have to like shop through there and kind of see what they have. Yeah. All right, we're going to go one side and lift ourselves up on your forearm like this. We're not going to hold it but 15 seconds. Well, this is because this is tougher. It is hard. 10 more seconds. Ooh, I'm it's cool. hard. Five, four, Three, two, one. Okay. Now, other side, and I'm gonna show you a different way. You can kind of cheat. You can do it this side. Another way to do it is, if you're just starting out, is just do five, instead of doing 15 seconds, do five of these. Up and down. Yeah. Up and down, try that. Okay. Okay, it is hard on you. We need a pad for our elbow too, I know that. Up and down, good. Oh Up. yeah, I can manage that. Three more. Three, two, one. Good. Isn't that tough, kind of? It is. So you guys got to try this if you're not down there. It really kind of isolates this area. It does. All right, back to a little bit of, now we got all our new carpet. <laughs> That's good. 
All right, back to our little kickboxing things. We're gonna go back to that move. So it's like that one, two, three, cross. You can add, this time we can lift the knee. So it's like this, back, two, three, knee up. One, two, three, cross, back, two, three, lift the knee. One, two, three, cross, back. Good job, about eight more of these. Give me some attitude, up. One, two, three, punch. Good job, one, two, three, cross. And elbows, good, and cross. About three more, you got it. Last one. And march it out. All right, I'm gonna switch a route. Put you over here. Okay, remember, so we're just doing the one, two, three. Come across with your body, and then on that back thing, lift that knee up. So it's one, two, three. Cross, we got about five more minutes. Lift. Give me a cross. Lift that knee. One, two, three. Cross. I love that twisting motion. It feels yeah, good. Yeah, get that upper body into it, and your trunk. One, two, three. Cross, back. Two, three, lift, one, two, three, punch, and lift, and cross, knee up, punch, good knee, three more, two more, last one, one, two, three, march it out, good job, okay, grab those weights, last weight thing, we haven't done much with our all right, what I'm gonna get you to do is get one of those black ones, if you will, Elizabeth. Okay. And we're gonna kinda start cooling it down. So I'm gonna get y'all in a lunge stretch, like this, but at the same time, we're gonna work our triceps. So Ooh. we're gonna take that weight overhead and about 10. So we're kinda like touching the back of our neck oh, and then see. lifting it up. Good. Keeping the elbows high if we can, trying to isolate the tricep muscle. You know, we don't want that flapping in the breeze with us. <laughs> That's right. Sleeve you wave the people, yeah. <laughs> I know, we got summer coming up. Four more. Although, it feels like summer outside now, so. In East Tennessee, you never know with the weather. It could be 80 one day and 40 the next. That's right. And we're going to go down and up. Two more of these. We can do it, guys. I can feel it in my triceps. Four more. Three. Two. I'll give you one more of these. Good job. Okay, set that weight down, a little water. <coughs> and we'll cool it down a little bit more. All right, we're gonna come, I'm gonna stand in front of my step. If you have one and all we're gonna do is heel taps back and forth kind of warming cooling down toe up heel down and just kind of moving our arms any way they want to go good good job is your little boy like to be active and outside oh, yes. he loves climbing here lately oh, i'll turn around he's climbed the fence <laughs> <laughs> i'm sure he's gonna keep me on my toes well that's a fun Which thing i'm okay with <laughs> east Tennessee now has more and more like little trails like, I am yes. um, take him to Ozone Fall later on when he gets a little older. True. Just short little hikes, you know, yeah. to explore. Okay, now what we're going to do is let's go and stretch out that hamstring because we've been using it. So kind of come back and heel down, toe up. Feel nice. Oh, yeah, that feels right good. There. Nice stretch. You guys are doing good. Remember, after we're done with the show, if there's a certain area that you know you need to stretch a little longer, Take the time and kind of work on that low back. Elizabeth, thanks for being on the show. Oh, thanks for having me. This is Next fun. Next time, make it harder for her. Make yeah. her sweat. You know? <laughs> True. Make the That'll be the goal. <laughs> and people can find you at? TheSpiff.com. Yeah. And you can follow me on Instagram at Spiffy Elizabeth. That's right, Spiffy Elizabeth. <laughs> And I'm sure you've got links on spiff.com. I do. Yeah. Pinterest, YouTube, even. Hold on, yours. <laughs> um, well, I know it. I'll have to get you to help us here put the show on YouTube. So yeah, put, true. Watch. We're going to do a little bit of a twist move here. Oh, we're going to lunge and a little bit of a twist for that low back. And I always tell people, remember, life is more fun when you're fit. So 
Thank you for something. We got in. Oh, that's good. We got in over 2,000 steps. Dang. So just right now. So. I always okay. like to think of the feeling after working out and how good it is. Yes. That helps me get through it. <laughs> helps me get off the couch. All right, y'all. Hold on a few more seconds. Good job. Big arm circles. Exaggerate those. Make that back feel good. Other direction. Good workout. A little, a little of it all. A little aerobics, a little weights, a little stretching. See you guys next time. Bye.